Hey everybody, today in the Modern Defender we are going to work on a basic striking progression that you can practice so you can become more proficient defending yourself with your walking stick. Stick around. So today we're going to take a, our, um, our, our defensive progression from a step-by-step -step basis from a position where I have someone approaching me and I'm just holding the stick down. I'm not holding it in a threatening position. But today, as Andrew, can you look at the camera, people are more emboldened now because they have masks on. Uh, you know, it's part of the part of your getup now is to wear a mask. So people are taking more risks because they're harder to identify. And I know the crime rate in my area has gone up and I'm sure it probably has in your area as well. Um, and I do believe the masks probably have something to do with that. People are more emboldened to commit a crime, less fear of getting caught due to being identified. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get off the line. Now, getting off the line means if there's someone coming straight at you, well, you don't want to stand still. You don't want to back up. You want to you, you want to move as you block. So all I'm going to do is Andrew is going to come up with maybe just go up to go out to grab me. I'm going to swing and I'm going to strike to the outside. Now. I've seen a lot of this crap uh, on YouTube with people telling you just swing your, swing your stick, swing your stick, swing your stick. Yeah, good luck with that, okay? If I swing my stick, Andrew's going to grab it, okay? Now he's got the stick, all right? You need to have two hands on your walking stick. When you're striking, not when you're walking, but when you're striking or blocking with your walking stick, two hands. Got to have two hands. So. I'm going to be in a static position, he's going to reach out, I'm just going to flip the walking stick into my hand and strike across. Now, I did it as a one, two. Yeah, that took a little bit of time, but as I practice it, bam, and get really fast with it. And again, it's a push and a pull, so I'm pushing his arm away, we're going to strike to the body. So if you guys remember those three strikes that I did in this video, the three basic strikes, the one and the two and the three. Okay, all I did here was I blocked with the one, getting off the line, striking with the two to the body. Okay, now I don't want to stay here very long because that's not a finishing strike. That's not a debil debilitating strike. All I'm going to do is step to the outside, whack him. He might turn at me at this point. I want to step out of the way and two hand swing. Okay, bam, to the face. Again, we're getting off the line. We're not staying still, we're changing our, our position. So he's trying to grab me here, suddenly I'm here and I'm hitting him, and bam, I'm whacking him in the back of the head. If you're serious about adding a walking stick in your toolbox of self-defense, okay, you need to practice. You need to become proficient with this thing. You need to take everyday carry and your self-defense skills seriously, all right? It's not just watching a video and, oh, I know how to do that. You need to practice, okay? Practice, practice, practice. Because you might find that, hey, Dan said do it this way, but I really find it just, it, just, it just makes more sense to block out this way than strike. Hey, there's nothing wrong with that. If it's effective, you're not making any mistakes, and you're in a position to put balance, power, and commitment into your strikes and blocks, um, then I have no problem doing that, okay? You gotta be flexible, and the only way you're gonna understand what works for you is if you practice, okay? Again, the first one, I'm just stepping off the line, uh, bad guy's coming at me, I'm off to the outside. Again, it's a quick block strike. All right, so let's do that on Andrew now. Quick block strike. And again, no one's gonna come at you like a zombie, okay? No one's gonna do that. Well, maybe a zombie will, but I mean, if he just tries to grab me quick, a six is hand in my face, okay? Or wants to point at me. They might do that. Bam, whack him, bam, to the body, spin, and just, it's just basically, kids, this is just a spin and a two-handed baseball bat swing, all right? There's nothing more powerful than a baseball bat swing with a walking stick, all right? And you don't need to be a rocket scientist to figure that out, all right? So, again, one, two, Spin and crush him, bam. And I doubt he's gonna get that second strike off. I'm doing this so fast, uh, that second strike is probably not gonna happen. And if it does, um, I'm gonna probably beat him to the punch, okay? So that's one of the things I wanted you to understand is, stand over here, Andrew, is 
I get to the outside, I hit him low. If he just turns and looks at me, he's gonna catch this right across the head, all right? So, practice it. Find a tree in your backyard, okay? The block, hit this tree low, spin. Hit the tree high. If you don't practice, you're never gonna figure out these techniques, okay? Hit me up in the comments down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next time on The Modern Defender. Stay safe out there, everybody.